when I first saw this image, I laughed. And then immediately after, I realized some sad stuff might actually happen. So let's talk about this. Before anything, I just want to say a huge congratulation to Mei for being the second sing pair in the game to get her fourth out. Her fourth five star out right below our bait goddess Lily. And not only that, she is also the first sing pair to our four freaking mega. Seems legit. There's a lot of different reactions from the community, obviously. I'm kind of neutral to this. So I just want to say Lily took seven months between her anniversary and costume Lily. Meanwhile, May only took five months between 2.5 anniversary and the end of July this month. So, you know, things are not looking so good. This is kind of sad, actually. And one more thing, obviously, I have to talk about is Brandon. May has freaking four outs. Meanwhile, Brandon is crying the corner from emotional damage that he still has no mega, no out, and he's the goddamn canon protagonist. May even has a freaking legendary. It is so sad. And on top of that, one thing I realized is that May is getting two starters, right? I mean, actually, before that, like, let's talk about her outfit and what Pokemon she's getting. So it's pretty clear that it's Blaziken, right? Just from the color scheme alone. You have red, yellow, orange, right? Very obvious. But the question is, is it going to have Mega? It's kind of obvious that it's yes. Maybe, maybe it's just speculation. This is not confirm anything. We don't even know if May is actually coming next update or next next update or I don't know. We don't know that, but it's very lucky. It's gonna be the very next update. So if you have, if you look at her ribbon, right? She has this like flame thing, ribbon thing, which is the same as uh, Blaziken's arm flame thing. So it's kind of clear that it's gonna be Mega from that alone. Probably don't quote me on that, but yeah, it's very lucky. And on top of that, she's getting two starters, right? She already has Swampert, and now she's getting Mega Blaziken. That made me realize that Gloria, who is getting her third out very, very soon, already has a starter in game, which is Italian, which means that it is actually possible for Gloria to get another out, her fourth out, with like Rillaboom or Cinderace, which is kind of scary when you think about it. It's gonna suck, it's gonna really suck if it, if it comes up before Victor is even in the game. But it is what it is. Now, let's talk about. The update that's coming end of July. We already know May is most likely coming, and May is from Hoenn. And DNA also teased that in the latest death letter, we are getting a new villain arc end of July. So that kind of you know complements well May Hoenn character coming soon. Hoenn villain arc also coming soon. And we still obviously have no information that if it's gonna be Master Fair, Poke Fair, but I think it's most likely gonna be Poke Fair. I say this because the end of this month should be the part 1 of the villain art, similar to like Sino and Johto. And I don't think they're gonna release Master Fair yet. I feel like they will release the Master Fair at the end of August. Because that is the anniversary, right? The end of August is the anniversary. So it makes sense to have the whole villain art part 2 and the anniversary on the same like time, right? timeline something so it makes a lot of sense for them to not make master fair this update i really hope i'm right i don't want any more master fairs i want to skip no more master fairs please until the anniversary you know it's kind of similar to like singer sumorti and singer giovanni right like they come out they came out one month before the second part of joto vinar right they came out on the first part of joto vinar then on the second part of joto vinar the triple singer Su joto trio came out so i feel like that's gonna happen again so may most likely gonna be poke fair i hope i pray to god Please be Poké Fair. No, no more Master Fair, please. I know DNA wants money, but save your money greeners for the anniversary. Thank you. Let's talk more about the Hoenn Villa, right? So we already know May is gonna get an out. The question is, who else is gonna get an out, right? Number one option, obviously, I want freaking Brandon to get an out. Like, dude, I would be so tilted if Brandon has no out at wow, her freaking female cotton pot has like four outs. Like, what the hell is this, DNA? Brandon, Brandon needs to have an out. Okay, it's a must. And then after that, I think Steven, very likely as well. She's a very, he's a, he's a very popular character. I don't know why he wouldn't have any out. And on top of that, I think Wally, hopefully. I do want Wally to get out, that would be cool. I don't know who, maybe like Jirachi or something. Whatever, right? And out for Wally would be nice. And then add in like some missing Hoenn characters like Watson. Juan, right? Just add them in, please, for the Hoenn villain art. Since you know, like the Jojo villain, every single gym leader and in it for at least mentioned, right? Chuck was mentioned in the story. 
he wasn't physically there, but at least he was mentioned or something. Please, DNA. At least add in some new Hoenn characters. And of course, next thing I want to talk about is Maxi and Archie rerun. Will we get them? I don't know. It's maybe unlikely, right? Since Leon still has no rerun yet, but let's be real, nobody gives a crap about Leon. We want Maxi and Archie rerun first because we are built different. But Maxi Archie rerun for maybe anniversary, I think, makes a lot of sense, right? Especially if part 2 is on, on August. And of course, next thing is Xenia, right? Xenia is very likely to get a Mega. Please, right? Mega, Rayquaza, change her freaking Area Ace to Dragon Ascent for some flying damage. And just increase some stats. And that's about it to make her decent, hopefully. And add some new passive for some more damage, right? Something like Weather Sync Up, Weather Search for the passive. Something like that, please, to make her good. And of course, we need new grids for the 3 star and 4 star Ho and Sync pairs. Hopefully, characters like Nolan, Lucy, Tate, Liza, Drake. No, three Hoenn Sing pairs get the grids. Please, that would be really nice. I'm praying for Drake and Liza because they are both pretty good support. Hopefully, they get some good stuff. Please, DNA, don't screw this up. Now, let's do a quick prediction on what May and Blaziken is gonna have, like, you know, like their movesets and stuff. Let's do just a quick prediction. So, obviously, May can Mega. And Mega Blaziken has the speed boost ability. So, for passive, most likely, it's just gonna have, like, Fast Track 9, 100% chance to pass 1 speed when you attack. Then I hope that she has some sort of inertia ramming speed stuff, some sort of speed multiplier, hopefully. If she ends up being attacked, she might have fighting zone, which I hope it doesn't happen because I want to save my gems of the anniversary. Don't do this to me DNA. Hopefully no zone, but I have a feeling that it's gonna have zone, it's gonna be attack. And for moves, hopefully some, something like Blaze Kick and High Jump Kick. And 3 gauge move. Both are pr I'm pretty sure new moves. They don't exist in the game yet. And then she may or may not have physical special speed thing. Right? Regular moves are physical like this kick, head jump kick. And then overheat as the sing move, right? Something something overheat special. Confirm high speed, high attack, high special attack. So May is coming very soon. And I just pray that Brandon at least get an out. Either next update or next next update. Hopefully as a master fair. You know, I prefer part 2, Brandon and some sort of like Latios or something. Master Fair with Mega. They better give him Mega or everybody is gonna suffer from massive emotional damage. <laughs>